in a unique manner, integrating existing solar systems of different manufacturers and made of independent, interconnected, decentralized PV systems, the Don Bosco Solar Mini Grid powers a large vocational training school compound in Ashaiman, Ghana, with solar power. It serves as a practical test for technologies in sub-Saharan conditions and a demonstration model to future solar technicians as a sample for rural electrification. The system interconnects six independent PV producers with 11 consumers so that each producer supplies first its demand and supplies the rest of the consumers connected to the solar grid with available surplus PV energy. Every producer can become a consumer in case of high demand or discharge batteries. Two prosumers even supply the grid at night with 3.8 kilowatts from battery capacity actively feeding into the grid like a tiny local power plant. The system has 477 PV modules with a total PV power of 164.4 kilowatts peak. Varieties of string inverters, battery inverters, chargers, battery technologies, charge controllers and communication interfaces of different brands have been implemented in one solar grid. Various battery technologies are tested on their performance in the hot temperatures and the dusty and salty air typical to sub-Saharan contexts. In this way, the solar grid can serve as an installation model for remote villages where some buildings already have PV systems from different brands installed. It also serves as a teaching tool in the other Don Bosco solar courses. Participants learn to use solar applications from various providers and how to combine with different technologies available in the Ghana market in one solar grid. Net metering and smart load management are implemented to control the different loads. As a result, high power consumers such as air conditioners, water heaters and water pumps are programmed to only run depending on the outside temperature, time of the day or when there is enough PV power production and battery charge. With the help of smart load management, more than 96% self-sufficiency has been achieved and the mini grid has high redundancy. By installing smart meters in each system and implementing third-party monitoring platform Grafana, remote supervision and control of the entire mini grid were achieved. However, bringing all the different technologies into one platform was difficult. All the information from monitoring the solar grid is then again used in the training of the solar technicians so they learn not only to install PV systems but to monitor and improve any existing installation and make it more cost-effective. Don Bosco has successfully built up this complex mini grid and uses it for demonstration and teaching purposes. However, to achieve 100% self-sufficiency, long-term storage technologies like hydrogen gas could be the solution and will be tested in the near future.